Let's well, stay in music. Let's right, stay well, in music. We talking about um, you know, coming off of BET Awards and stuff. Um, we got Grammy Awards. Uh, Tommy Richmond. Your man. Your cousin. Y'all man. That's y'all mm. man. That's y'all's man. He's at y'all cookout. Who's y'all's? I disagree with so many of the white people that they said are allowed to I the cookout. I disagree with all of them. I agree <laughs> with some of the black people that they let to the cookout, but that's a story for another time. <laughs> but yeah, so Tommy Richmond is submitting for rap song. Of, uh, of the year. All the categories. Yeah, all, all, all the rap. Just, yeah. Wait, so he's submitting, he wasn't, there's no nomination. Well, the nominations aren't out yeah. Okay. But you have to do a You have to you say have to what your submission before they submit. Yeah. yeah. Tommy Richmond, who just a few weeks earlier yep. said, said, I am not a hip hop, a hip-hop mm-hmm. act. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hmm. At this point, I'm confused, honestly. You either fucking with people or you on bullshit. Or you just really don't know any better and maybe you're being handled poorly. So to your point from a couple of weeks ago, Tommy Richmond would have done himself a service by shutting the fuck up. Absolutely. True. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. That being said, I wouldn't have liked, even if he never said none of that hip-hop shit, that song being nominated in rap categories would be weird to me still. I agree. Same. It's not a rap song. It would be, but I wouldn't mind. But I wouldn't mind because that. now I'm gonna I'm yeah. do what I the can do. The melodic rap song, I'm, I'm with because there is a separate yeah, category for melodic, melodic rap. rap. I'm not yeah. mad at that, even though I still don't know if it's that. But to general rap categories, it's not. It's not that. But we wouldn't have kicked his back in yeah. so much if he would have just shut up and submitted to. Yeah, my oh, handler's going to oh, put a. Yeah. We're going to put a. We, that in that case, you're trying to win wherever you could win yes. because you've been running your mouth on said issue. Now we look at it like, well, nigga, why you don't go submit? Get the fuck out of here. To, like, to whoever you're yeah. trying yeah. to be. Mm-hmm. Yes. I understand that that may be a more difficult win. Yeah. For sure. Yes. Mm-hmm. So you strut your ass over here and then turn your face up mm-hmm. at us. Now, and, that's, and that's where people are like, all right, dog. And I, again, I haven't heard but so much of his music. I don't know if he fire enough to behave this way. I don't love this, uh, whatever the name of his hit is, million, million enough dollar, baby. for him to hey, behave hey. that way. I love the beat. I recognize that it has the chopped and screwed elements. I do rec- I do recognize the elements of hip-hop that it has. Sure. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now, let me just ask. Not, and but his, it ain't. His performance ain't rapping, It ain't though, at which all. Which, not at his all. song, and that's so, how it should go. Not at even all. Even when the tweet came out, you know, like I said, I, I told y'all why I could understand what maybe what he meant by the tweet. Is it possible that, because the artists themselves don't do that submission shit. That'd be your label, that'd be your team, that'd be some of that. So they could be sitting there saying, hey, look, our song performed and did this. We are submitting this over here where we might have a better chance at a win. Mm -hmm. This really ain't got shit to do with you at this point. It's like playing a dollar to win the lottery. I understand. Yeah, yeah, nobody's mad at them. I'm not not going to necessarily hold that again. If If he's saying I'm not hip-hop, hold on. If he's saying I'm not hip-hop, but my label... Is going to say, well, nigga, shut your ass up. We submitting you for, for rap, regardless. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to hold that against him. Got to. That's all I'm saying. I have to hold it against him because it's you don't your job. Shit. It's your job. Got it. But as casual consumers, the label is not planning for around the people that, all right, nobody knows shit. We just moving on on the court for our best interest. Right. It's his job to be lock and step with the people that he's in business True. with. True. True. Okay. And so, somebody should have had the conversation with yeah. him weeks earlier. Hey, this is how we're submitting. If you are, I go, yeah. they well, might well, not well, but you don't know. So, I make my stupid ass statement. What makes it nastier to me is that maybe he did know, and that's why he tweeted that shit. Yeah. Oh, you know, man, that's a good that, one. That's a good that one. That makes sense. That's a good point. That's that makes one. sense. Let one, me get ahead one, of this. Once it's submitted one. that way, I was like, oh, he's taking a stand. That he was a taking one. a stand yeah. against something. Yeah. Hmm. That's a good point. All right, so he might not know any better because you don't want to mosey on down there to the Taylor Swift land yeah. and to Billie Eilish yeah. land. Like, I don't know, Tom. And, Tom, Tom yeah. and, the and to some of these folks that but, don't know no better, the term hip-hop has a certain connotation to it that they don't want to be a part of. We just saw yeah. a report come out where the Miami Dolphins did not hire Mike Tomlin yeah. because they said he, he was, was too hip-hop. hip-hop. Yeah. Why they had the opportunity to hire Mike Tomlin back in 07 uh, and said uh, we did not hire him because he was too hip-hop. Just, pub- that's funny because I think Homeboy, their coach, is mad. They publicly, yeah. they publicly said that. I, no, I don't think so. I've never heard that. Yeah. Well, how how, how do we know that this that was said? Just just it's, just came out. Yeah. Because if that's true, that's basically saying he's too black. Yes. 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 Very much so. Which is what we say. And why would they say that he was too hip hop? Because they can't say he's too black. 
How, so we how is that him? a fucking identifier, though? That's crazy. That's how I hope that's false. No. Okay. Because in my opinion, every 22-year-old black boy that you now are going to get and that, that you now um, are drafting, mm. they all too hip-hop, too. So the, the, good, the dudes is good enough to be hip-hop to play for you, but not good enough to be in a managerial role. That speaks to the organization. Mm-hmm. Yo, let me you get what I'm saying? Like the kids that you drafted, they not too hip hop to be running back punts on your team or to be catching fucking touchdowns for sure. your team, putting revenue in y'all pockets. But the black man that's going to be coaching these kids would be quote unquote too hip hop. That's disgusting. Yeah, I, hope that's, that's Yo, I hope that's fake. I hope that's fake. What if he was doing it in reverse? Meaning like, you know how the Macklemore shit won? What if he's saying that, you know, you put in, I'm a white guy, I put my son there just in case it win. I don't want anybody to think that I may have felt it deserved to win compared to the other songs. Say that when you get up there. You know what I'm saying? So what if, the, in getting in front of it, that was his intent? Like, gotcha. yo, I, you know, because he probably felt like it's not hip hop, but these some of these songs, I don't know, I don't want to base it off of the skin, but a lot of these songs that don't deserve to win end up winning. So what if he just doesn't want to offend the culture? I don't know. Yeah, you took it to my next thought. I understand the submitting. Mm-hmm. The win is going to be the uproar. Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. for sure. We've if he this. were to win in this, mm-hmm. these categories, and unfortunately, being and with the popularity of the song, yep. it probably stands he a good chance it, to win. He can't, yeah. can't, he can't yeah. be. It's interesting. I, 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 I don't have them win. I don't. I don't have them beating. I don't have like a, what's it? Not like, not, not like us. But melodic uh, yeah. rap or something like that, he might stand a better chance in. I think that this not is like totally just freestyling. I think that the the board may like getting some of these famous TikTok dudes uh-huh. so we can put it in the commercial or advertise that you're nominated. But I do think that the Grammy board still tries to have some integrity as to who and how it's won. Well, typically, so they change, well, they, they typically change the people shit, right? that vote, which I may or may not vote this year, we'll see. Uh, it's your, in the Grammys. Situation. Actually, it's, are in the fucking the hip-hop peers. culture. Your you peers. know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. your they, peers. They changed some of that, right? Yeah. As a, yeah. I don't vote because you have to vote in all categories. That's not true. When you fill out you the pick, thing? You pick out um, certain ones. You can, only, you can only vote, I think, I want to say, I think I only was able to vote hip-hop and R&B for the most part. You can pick which ones you want to vote. You only have a certain amount of votes. You can't do hip-hop and R&B and, and country. Oh, yeah. And you'll, run out of, you'll run out yeah. of categories. Okay. I didn't uh, know that. It's been a few years. I could have swore that thing said. I think they changed it a couple years ago. A few that's, years that's ago. What yeah. That's what it is. Because that was my problem. You had to vote Back in the day, clearly. So you for every category, and you I'm not well versed in every category, and I don't want to skew a vote. That so in, yeah. in 2023, the Grammy, they uh, the just recording, changed that. The Recording Academy dropped the number of fields from 26 to 11. So that's what before you you had the all 26, yes. that's 11 votes. Uh, mm-hmm. got yeah, it. You can only give more flexibility, so you can only. So people are most likely going to stay to the oh, shit they know. Yeah. 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 know. So if you're a voter, you could vote the three or four R&B, the three or four hip hop, pop, Correct. and stop yeah. it right mm-hmm. there. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, that's all you can do. Gotcha. No, yeah. that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Because yeah. it's not that many people, unless you're just a music aficionado, that's going to be as well versed in country music For as sure. they yeah, are. Yeah, the best gospel hip-hop. album. Well, that's yeah, what was yeah, happening. Even, and that's what was happening. Yeah. So, gotcha. they were, so now you start, you don't know nothing about rap. All right, well, well, I heard of this song right yeah, here. True, cool, true, let true. me vote for that. I don't true. know what the fuck none of these records I was rel- are. I'm relatively well-versed in other genres, so I started trying to vote for a bunch of shit, and then it, like, stopped me. Gotcha. It was like, you can only submit this amount. And I was Good. like, all right, mm-hmm. let me go gotcha. vote that's, on the shit that I know. the shit that I want and I want to be a part and of. And I want to that makes boost. Sense. That's gotcha. great news. Hmm. I hope that Tommy Richmond loses every category. <laughs> <laughs> What's interesting, he signed to Brent. That, that's bad. Yes. <laughs> yes, nigga. <laughs> Yo, y'all be telling me so much shit is bad that I don't, I don't think that's bad. Think bad. I don't why? think that's bad because what, 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 what category do we deserve to win? What's his he reason? might go win pop. He can't he, win pop. He is not beating Sabrina Carpenter. I'm just no, getting out of the show. No, I'm not. I'm saying, but to T. want Swizzle him to lose. You know that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I don't, not, I'm saying, to, but to want him to lose. Oh, like, yeah, Taylor yo, shit. Yeah, Taylor. <laughs> he, he don't stand a snowball's chance. And which is why they said we putting your ass over here in rap. Yeah. If, he wins, if, he, if he wins in rap, I'm going to feel like they playing in our face that and is, trying to slight us. That is. Yeah. Kendrick should That's win. That's how I'm Kendrick's, down. Kendrick's winning in rap. Kendrick should win hands down. Like it shouldn't Kendrick's probably close. performing there and but winning. I, I and would like them up. to pan the camera over to Tommy Richmond's white face so I could see it as he loses. But I don't know if he has the profile for them to do that. 
No. Like, I think the song is much more popular than him. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, that, sure. that, that is true. If he yes. walked by me on the street, I, I, know. I, I would, would not know, know what he looked like. Yeah. They done took yeah. that song. That's in commercials. I think I, yeah. I think it was like Target yeah. or something. Like yeah. that song is that. out of here. Yeah. 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 It's a million dollar baby. And he's been around for a second. He's like signed to Brent Fias's label. Um, and like, even that's a smoke screen. Yeah. Well, I don't know. But all what they do to make these dudes pop. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's true. He's like, mm -hmm. you know, trained in opera. Like a lot of his classification of his so music go, is go there. Yeah, okay. is alternative <laughs> or R and B soul or pop. Uh. Like this is really his one and only hip hop record. Oh, you read his press package? <laughs> yeah, well, no, I just I, because I really <laughs> did. Uh, no, got, I was curious. She got his deck. Yo, we cracking on you. She got the oh, deck. No, but I was really like curious. Chill, 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 chill. Send me your deck. I'm going to see if I get you to the JVP. An opera singer. She knows. 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 She you want to go look at uh, Homeboy? Mel wouldn't date Tommy Richmond. No, not she would not. No. no, she would not. I don't even know. If he looked different, you would? If he looked different than what he looks like? Mm -hmm. I think that there, I think it's my criteria is bigger than would just, you oh, you have a successful oh, you song. Felt, you fell for the trap. <laughs> my question to you, <laughs> you was <laughs> if he looked you different, got out the trap. <laughs> would you date him? Probably not. Why problem? Is it an age thing? Well, no. But this, you know, you guys know this is a very weird question. Why is it? No, we don't. Oh, she's triggered again. Oh, <laughs> got him. Oh, got him. Oh, no, no, you can't say she didn't use the word. Oh, she because then why? You why? Can't give it a why am word. I not out trying to actively date everybody that I find attractive, whether they play sports or or music or well, actors? Well, you don't know shit. Shut the uh, fuck up. If they came across your path. No, that doesn't even guarantee that I would be interested. I can appreciate, you know, a pretty face and a nice body and not want to do anything with it. That's true. I think he's got a bod. <laughs> he definitely does not have a bod. Not from what I can see. Tommy Richmond, bad luck. <laughs> Honestly, yo. Honestly.